2023 Mother Gaia Third dimensional planet Ascending Into fourth dimensional Collective consciousness Azor Grand Rising Captain Can you give me the update On third dimensional planet Gaia Yes Christo with pleasure Gaia 3D currently is under critical condition. It seems there is a large amount of humans that have forgotten who they are, causing confusion, division and war driven by fear. Thank you Azor. Before we head down to Gaia, can you give me any information about the 3D world as it's been a while since I've been there? Sure, the 3D Gaia. We will face much resistance from negative polarity beings as a dual plane. Karma and Dharma are in effect, there is free will. It will be wise to protect our energy and hold love. Alright, thank you Azar. Sounds like we have quite the task at our hands. But, that's why we're here. And that's why we've been called upon in the Galactic Federation. To go down to planet Gaia, the 3D realm. Alright Azar, let's get ourselves ready to go. Let's hit the time portal and make sure we land in the present day Mother Gaia, third dimension. <laughs> Okay, okay, let's, let's try, try this, this one. one. Maybe, Maybe this, this is the portal. Oh, uh, yeah. Azor, this is a little, little too far, far in the future. future. I think, I think we, we need to kind of go back a little bit. There, there we, we go. go. Perfect. Perfect. Modern, Modern day Earth. Earth. Captain Christo, as we approach, I will prepare our guest suite on the mothership for the souls we hold space for. Oh, and Captain. I will be sure to leave plenty of storage for earthly food delights to take for our travels. <laughs> oh my gosh, Azor, you never fail to make me laugh. You know those earthly delights? That good old food of Earth. Absolutely gotta have that food of Earth. Thank you, Azor. Alright. It is time. It's time to make our way down to 3D Gaia. To hold space, show love, compassion, bridge the conscious collective, and help provide knowledge and wisdom and tools so fellow souls can remember who they are, live in a unified mind state the harmonious being with holistic conscious practices and tools that they may access efficiently and quantumly welcome aboard i am azor please get cozy grab a tea snacks or crystals as we prepare for a sacred light conversation the sacred holding space is down the hall to the left. Wholeness balanced love.
Hey, Zor. Hey. Grand day, Captain. Well, first of all, Azor, what is taking so long with those cookies that I asked for? And number two, now that we have our sacred guest from planet Earth that is here to share their story, their wisdom and knowledge for the rest of the tribe, can you go ahead and pull up their background and go ahead and share with the rest of the tribe a little bit about our sacred guest on this coming episode? Crystal, I had to get more cookies from the store they call Whole Foods on Earth during our stop with your diet. Two minutes on the timer. Our sacred guest Lisa Cavanaugh, based out of Ontario, Canada. Lisa is an intuitive energy therapist, certified hypnotist and regressionist and a Reiki master teacher. She is also an active member of the National Guild of Hypnotists since 2019. Practicing for eight years, Lisa received her first level Reiki certification in 2014 and master's in 2017. She graduated in 2012 with high honors from Centennial College's Addiction Studies program with a certificate in counseling skills. Gracias, Azor. Thank you so much. Thank you. And I cannot wait for those cookies. I'm so glad you got them. I appreciate it. Thank you for expecting my diet. And they should be ready in just a moment. Just in time for the podcast. How perfect and divine time. And for everybody else, to the rest of the tribe, Get cozy and enjoy this Sacred Light conversation with Lisa Cavanaugh out of Ontario, Canada. As we'll be exploring hypnosis, holistic healing, and how to be conscious and self-aware of your energy field. Feel free to leave comments and feedback. Wholeness, balanced love. Chocolate chip cookies. <laughs>